What is up guys, welcome back to another great episode of Bronze. And today we're going to be playing some Fahrenheit Indigo Prophecy Remastered. One of my all-time favorite games, and we are going to play this because it is winter time here in Michigan, and this is the best game to play in winter. But seriously, this game is fantastic, and I'm really hoping you guys enjoy this. We have actually started it before, but it was back when I didn't have the greatest quality of videos yet, so we're just going to restart it, seeing we were only two episodes in back then. So, why not just quick restart it, get a nice fresh start, but anyways guys, let's just start us a new movie. By the way, this is also by the guy who made um, Heavy Rain and Beyond Two Souls, and I believe Until Dawn... Maybe that's a different one, but yeah, he's pretty much my favorite game director ever. And Omicron, the Nomad Soul, his very first game. The game was on Dreamcast and shit, guys. You guys gotta play that. It's great. All of his games are kind of movie-like. They're very, very cinematic. Very... They always have different endings, that's for Things sure. Things are never quite what they seem. No, they're we not. think we understand the world around us, but we really only see the outside. What it seems to be. I used to be just like you. I believed in humanity, the newspapers, soap the newspaper. commercials, politics, and history books. But one day, the world kicks you in the teeth, and you don't have any choice but to see things the way they really are. Yeah. My name is Lucas yeah. Kane. My story is the one where an ordinary guy has something extraordinary happen to him. <laughs> Maybe it was supposed to happen. Maybe it was my destiny or my karma or whatever. I know one thing for sure. Nothing's ever going to be the same again. It can be though, Lucas. We can save your soul, man. And we will. We will save his soul throughout this game. Maybe not. We may end up killing him or sending him to jail or I don't know. I don't know. I've only played this game once, so I only know one ending and I barely even remember that. <laughs> Alright, so all here's started the beautiful right city. Here. Where else could it happen? New York, capital of the universe. The chessboard Destiny chose for the last big game. I was just another pawn living my pawn's life. Until that night, when my life descended into chaos. So interesting. So beautiful. And with this remastered version, I mean, there's not too much of a difference in the graphics, but there is a little bit, so I guess it's kind of nice. And it's really, really cheap, so on G2A, I think it's like probably five, ten bucks or something. It's honestly a fantastic game. You should seriously be playing it yourself, but I'm glad to have you guys with me here playing this game. It's going to be amazing. And this goddamn crow likes to follow us everywhere. Get out of here, you damn crow. Written directed by David Cage, the best goddamn video game writer ever. <laughs> In my own opinion, of course. He's taking a leak. That's normal. That, I, don't, I don't know why we're watching him. Like, this is a very weird intro. <laughs> oh shit. Dude. Dude. What are you doing in there? Why would you do that in a restaurant bathroom? Why would you do that at all? No. There's better things you can do. What's talking about? Going on, man. I can't control my baddie. Can't control my baddie. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. Look behind you, man. How does he not notice this? This is the biggest part of the game that it just baffles me. How does this guy not see me behind him? He's staring right into a mirror. Oh, Jesus. I can't stop myself. Oh god. It's so intriguing. Don't do it, Lucas. You weren't born for this boy. This is not your calling. No. Forget who that guy in the trench coat is too, so that's awesome. This is the main villain here, obviously. I think. I think he's possessing me right now. <laughs> who the hell are you? You look like the girl from Murder Soul Suspect. You really do. Oh fuck. Oh! 
What have I done? What have what? I done, Crow? What, what have I done? Oh, minus 60, damn it. Yes, guys, you have a depression meter in this game, and if it goes all the way down, you do kill yourself, so I, be very I wary of that. <laughs> you gotta find so ways to keep your guy happy, keep him not on edge all the time. It's actually a pretty interesting mechanic here. I'll show you all the things that we can do to kind of cover up this body scene. Quick. I, I've, I've got to get out of here before somebody comes in here. We're going to get out of here, man. All right, when this icon is in the upper right corner is on screen, your progress is automatically saved on the hard drive. Well, that, that's that's cool. Wait, F9? Wait, what? Can I change it in between? <gasps> no, I don't do that. I don't get it. This is standard. And this is HD. All right, not too much of a difference. Let me quick check, make sure that I didn't mess up my recording. Okay, good. I didn't mess anything up. First of all, we need to come over here to... No, don't go out the window. You don't need to go out the window, man. That, that's, that's not what we're doing here. Shit, man. Come on, what are you doing? What are you doing? Not doing it anything that I wanted you to do. Fine, come over here. Uh, maybe we should do this. We should probably move this guy. That's what I'm thinking. Oh shit, this. Uh, it's so s it's the struggle, man. This actually gets very, very hard later on in the game. <laughs> Alright, now quick drag over to the toilet. I also like how you choose all your options and stuff. You just kind of drag your mouse and stuff. It's just really cool, really different way of doing things. Alright, now what can we do? Can we take this? Yes, grab the broom. Hurry up. Let's clean this place because we are a goddamn citizen. And that's what we do. Oh shit, I gotta do this a few times, don't I? Damn it! Quit doing that. Quit. Quit your nonsense, guy. What the hell? It ain't working. Um. No, damn it. Okay, we need to pick that back up. This is not going as planned, guys. Not at all. <laughs> Alright, come on, hurry. Oh, there we go. I gotta keep doing this. Now I'm getting it. Boom, boom, boom. Boom. Yes! Blood's gone. And as you see, that gets us, and now we're just anxious, all right? We're, we're doing a little bit better. All right, the murder weapon should be somewhere around here, right? Where are you, murder weapon? There you are. Let's pick up this knife, and knife. let's quick hide it. I've got to get rid of it. All right, do it, man. Do it! Oh, shit. Tell me it's not already coming back here. I barely had very Time. Okay, he's not getting up yet. We just know that the cop is in the building. All right, now let's quick come over here. Damn you, camera. Damn you. Damn you, order hell. Um, let's go like this. Out of order. Fuck, why did. Why even the option? <laughs> all right, quick wash our hands. Get all this blood off of us. We shouldn't have all this stuff on us. It's crazy. Come on, come on. That was, that was really epic music for just washing our hands. <laughs> Alright, let's see if this takes away something, too. Yeah, we're just normal. Alright, that we can just come out, we can jump right out of the window, but I don't know if we should do that. You know what, we're gonna, we're gonna, fuck it. Let's just go. Let's just get the hell on out of here. <laughs> go, Lucas, he's coming, man! It's barred up. I can't get out this way. Oh, no, 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 no. That's very bad. That's very bad for us. All right, come on, open the door. Oh shit. Okay. Hey, how's it going, man? There's nothing out of the ordinary here, you know. It's all normal. Okay, go, 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 go. Back door. Back door. Back door. Now, leave. Oh shit. Oh, go. That was really close, man. I've never had that close of an encounter. Usually I can walk out of the building out of this before he gets before the up to like, check Nobody anything. goes anywhere. Oh shit, shit, shit. He's going outside. The crime has just been committed. I'm going to have to ask Oh, to but I left my stuff there like my book and stuff. And that really fucks you over later. I assure you that, but you will find out. <laughs> All right, Harry, get to the taxi before anybody else gets here. Bam, bam. Open this. Woo! We done did it. Lucas plus 10. Oh, that's good. Brooklyn. We're out of there. Damn it, but the cops saw our face. Which is not good at all. What's going on with you, man? Oh shit, he saw me leave, didn't he? He's a witness. Don't tell me he's gonna tell on me later on in the game. Like, I, I've forgotten so much stuff about this game, it's ridiculous. Doc's Diner. Negative 10 degrees Celsius. God damn, that's cool. Doc's diner. 
that's it. Why do they always wait for me to go on duty before they start killing each other in the middle of the night? Tyler, that's what shit happens, somebody gets Tyler. murdered every day in New York. But especially when I'm on night duty. These are other it's two as if every psycho in the city has three it different in for. people in this game, which is awesome. If you want a bitch, do it inside. That way I don't have to freeze to death listening to it. <laughs> Carla, You're the boss. So snappy. Alright, let's go. Alright, so let's quickly do this. Five years on the force, I've seen some murders, wrap up. But you never really get used to death. You just learn to live with it, that's all. I still don't know if it was fatigue, or cold, or something else. But I clearly remember the bad feeling I got when I walked into that restaurant. As if some part of me already knew that this time, something was different. This is our biggest case yet. At least that's how it seems. Um, how do I change people? I totally... I totally forget. I don't know how. How's it going, McCarthy? Evening, Inspector. I've been waiting for you. Hey, Tyler. Hey, Martin. So, what happened? Homicide. Probably a stabbing, from what I could see. Looks like it's it went down in the toilets. Martin. I don't the know The murderer what, got though. away. Who is uh, the victim? victim? His name was, uh... John Winston. A regular here at the restaurant. Kate knew him. She could tell you more. Not a kid. Um, Any witnesses? Murder. Yeah, me. I was in the toilets at the same time the guy was. By the time I discovered the body, the suspect had already left. Man, that's really gonna change up the game for me. <laughs> what were you doing here? Like seriously, I've were never you on gotten. Duty? I wasn't. So close I just to happened caught. to be here when the murder happened. I like to come by here after work. Kate's coffee is the best in the East End. Um, is that the waitress over there? Yeah, Kate Morrison. I think that you should interrogate her. If you don't mind me saying, go easy on her, Inspector. She's still in a state of shock. Which table was the suspect sitting at? Oh, he was sitting at that table over there. Thanks for your help, Martin. There. It's late. Our DNA's on the cup and sleep. forks and shit. This I'm gonna wait good. until you're finished with Kate, if you don't mind. I want to make sure she gets home okay. I think she'll make it home, all right. Oh, well, when the symbol appears at the top right of the screen, you can switch characters. Press the two button anytime to switch characters. All right, let's quick go do that. Listen, Back to his then, little wrap up. We didn't know anything yet. We just thought it was cold, you know. If I had known, I probably would have stayed in bed that night, not gotten out till it was all over. That's the problem. If we knew ahead of time what was going to happen, we'd never leave the house. Alright, well, let's go investigate. We'll go talk to uh, this waitress over here. She's got some words to say to us. Some things to say. <laughs> Kate? I'm Inspector Carla Valenti. I'm in charge She's of lying. the investigation. She's lying! I can see it in her face. <laughs> Would you mind answering a few questions? No. Go ahead. I will go ahead. Um, victim. Did you yeah, know the victim well? John was a regular. He came every Monday. He always ordered the same thing and I left a nice tip. Um, Can you tell me anything about the customer who left just before they discovered the body? He was just a normal guy. I, I didn't really pay any attention to him. How about his what was the man doing before the murder happened? <laughs> like, seriously, this is he weird. It's like interrogating for a while. Somebody. Learn about what they reading, think about I us. Think. Send in somebody else. Um, somebody else, what description. Was he like, Kate? Do you think you could describe him for me? I only saw him for a few seconds. I guess he was about average height, fairly young. That's all I can remember. It's all right, Kate. We're gonna, we're gonna get through this. Uh, Did you John get suspect. the impression that John and the suspect knew each other? No, I don't think they did know each other. The man had already been here a while when John came in. They didn't talk to each other. No, I'm, I'm almost certain that John didn't know him. I was possessed, man. It was an accident. You can't hold me for that. Do you know what whether a... the victim had any enemies? Seriously, man, I was Anybody possessed. That I can want to kill plead him. insanity. John was just a nice, normal guy. Get out of guy. it easy. I can't see why anybody would want to kill him. Uh, can facts. you tell me what you saw? There weren't that many people tonight. It's usually pretty calm during the week. I was just chatting with Martin at the bar. I didn't even see John get up. Oh my god. It's 
All right, lady. Um, you have to up. try to be strong, Kate. I Let's know cheer up. You're a strong and You're the only one who can help us find the suspect. You can do this. You can, come on. You can tell us My the shift was almost over. I was just chatting with Martin at the bar. John got up and went to the restroom. The man must have followed him. When he came back out, I noticed that he hadn't paid his bill. I'm careful, because that happens a lot here, people forgetting to pay their bill. What happened next? I wanted to pay the, the bill. The guy just oh, ran off without paying. The cop got up way too it fast. It wasn't until Martin found John's body that I realized... Realize what? What happened before the murder? Did you notice anything unusual? No. It was just a night like any other. John Bazaar, suspect Did you are... happen to notice anything strange about the suspect's I'm behavior? I'm pretty sure they're both just normal. The These all seem like the same no. question. You wait. Yes. I remember something. I came back at one point just to check whether he needed anything. He didn't answer me. He just stared straight ahead. It was weird. I didn't push it. I thought maybe this guy is a little crazy. God, if I had only known. Do you think that you would recognize the suspect? I'll never forget that face. Perfect. Do you think that you could come down to the station tomorrow and help us construct a likeness of the killer? Yeah. I'll do whatever you think I can to help catch him. Thank I you don't know very about much that. for that. See, I control both sides of the story, which I is weird because I can put it, it to their favor, People like or I can that put it to Lucas's favor, to or I can swap it up. I promise you, we'll there's do so many different ways to, to be playing this game. Go home now and try to get some sleep. Martin will make sure you get home okay. Good job, Martin. You're a good man. You always have been. All right, let's go get some evidence already. Oh god, oh, this take forever. Good night. Alright, let's go. Getting tired, guys. You gotta go to work soon. Um, keep going. Go to the bathroom. Alright, to the bathroom. Go in here. Oh, it's a unisex bathroom. Made that interesting. Don't see those in diners. <laughs> Alright, so what should we come and check out? Um, I'm, I'm, we're gonna go. Can we go to the body first? Yes, we can. All right, we should probably check out this body. Make sure there ain't Several nothing in here. Several wounds on the left side of the chest, in the area of the heart. They appear to be knife wounds. Mm, interesting. All right, let's switch to Tyler, because basically the only thing that we need to do in here, well, we should probably open this door real quick, even though I don't want to give too much evidence, so I'm not going to, I don't, well, there's just blood, so I know he cut himself, but that's... Do you know I think that's about it. Um, family? let's check the trash can. I know. What well, could be inside? I wonder what. Just what <laughs> exactly are you doing, Tyler? I'm checking for clues. What do you think? No. I swear. I swear he finds that. All right, maybe Carla needs to check about it because I'm pretty sure it's in the goddamn trash can and not. All right, so no, it is. It's over here. No it's trace over here. of a struggle. Gotcha. Looks like the guy was taken totally by surprise. Here, bam! It's really not the best you place to hide. You ever consider a career in oh, oh, wait, this one. You ever consider They a might actually change it for the remastered Hey, version. everybody That's says I'm a cool. very funny guy. All right, so then where are we gonna check? Honestly, I have no idea. Not out the window. Did I even pick it up? I did. I know I did. Maybe go over here. Man, stab some dude in the toilet? You gotta be crazy. This guy. You gotta be crazy. Um. Damn, I could have sworn it was in there. And so we got the dryer. We got all this stuff. Plus this. Maybe in this version they put it in a different stall. Like, I'm real stumped on this. <laughs> it's real confusing. Alright, yeah. Looks like we can't check Bizarre. something. What? Well, he still has his credit card and a hundred bucks in cash on him. I guess the killer wasn't after his money. Hell no, it was an accident, I told you. This was not intentional. Keep going this way. Check this. Toilet. Alright. 
They did change the spot. That's actually kind of cool. All right, so the game's going to be a little different for me to play. I'm actually kind of happy about that. Unless there's a gang running, running around running hiding bloody, bloody knives and toilets, I think I might have found the murder weapon. This is the original you find Wait. in the trash. Tell Garrett, so have him check for prints on the handle. Okay. Will do. All right, let's quick go talk to Gary. Come on, Gary. Get your snow off my lawn, Gary. <laughs> Let's go talk to these witty mofos over here. They always got something to say, you, don't Cameron, you? Tyler. Yeah, this is my third night on call in a row. You know me, man. If I don't get my beauty sleep, it's Zombie City. Uh, you should be out of here pretty soon now. <laughs> you don't know Carla. She's capable of keeping everybody up till breakfast. Man, she is by far the most stubborn girl I ever met. Seriously? Hey, Garrett. Carla wants you to verify two or three things. Don't worry, I wrote it all down on this paper so you wouldn't forget. I had a feeling that Carla was going to keep us up a little longer. All right, so now what? Uh, we got to switch to Carla. We do have to switch to Carla. Cook over here. Let's talk to all these people. Hey, Garrett. Hey, Frank. How's it going? Hey, Carla. Hey, Carla. So, you guys find anything? We took some samples here and there. We're almost finished. We were just waiting for you before we took the body away. That's just fine and dandy, but where the hell did Tyler go? It's Tyler, I'm gonna take a look outside. Oh no, that's not what I wanted to do at all. I wanted the, I wanted to get in this damn car. Tyler's got the keys to the car. I better go find him. Ah. All right, let's switch to Tyler. Let's quick head outside, and I'm pretty sure that we can leave now. We've got all the evidence and stuff that we got before we head over to the next part of the mission. But yeah, guys, this is, well, well, I think I think Carla's got something else to say. Um, you ready to go, Tyler? I think I've seen everything I need to see. Are you sure? We can take another look around if you want. Um, no, nope, we're good. Let's head home. Okay, let's bust. Cool. Carla agrees to go. Hell yeah, let's we get don't into get the out car before she changes her mind. Get out of here today. All right, guys. I am going to have to end this episode right here. I really hope you're enjoying the series. I know you've probably already seen this episode. Maybe you have a newcomers if you enjoyed it please subscribe and like just because it helps the channel out makes me get a little bit more motivated but yes guys this has been bra we've been playing fahrenheit and like us from michigan have yourself a wonderful day and i hope you stay tuned for more let's quick let's quick watch this for you Alright guys, alright, I'll see you guys later. Did I kill him? I think I did, I think I did that, but I don't know! <laughs> I'm so excited! We Shit! Destroyed the objective. Was I supposed to do that? I think we're winning. Maybe not. Maybe not. How many kills do I have even? Oh, does it?